Hi, this is Dr. Jose Barrera. I'm here with my patient today. Uh, we are going to do a revision rhinoplasty and also uh, place a permalip lip implant. So tell me, why do you want to do rhinoplasty today? Well, I'd always had an issue with my nose growing up when I broke it when I was seven. And um, well, when I had gotten it fixed originally um, elsewhere, um, it ended up obviously being worse than intended. Um, so, ended up finding you, and you know, even my mom agrees, whenever she comes down, you're who she's going to, because oh, you are, that. she calls you the angel of oh, noses. Oh, that's so nice, that's so nice. <laughs> and, um... <laughs> I didn't pay her to say that. <laughs> <laughs> and, well, you know, I would like to honestly be able to breathe and yes. not sound like uh, Lois Griffin anymore from Family Guy, because that's, it's really attractive. And, and part of the operation is to help you breathe better, mm -hmm. and part of it is also to help fix the aesthetics. Mm -hmm. yeah. And what about the lip implant? Why the lip implant? Well, I kind of have a manly upper lip, and you know, I'd like, like to you know, look a little bit more pouty, you know, be pretty, yeah. feel pretty about it. You are pretty. So I think that, <laughs> um, especially with the lip implant, it's just a natural way mm -hmm. to get a little bit more volume without having to do fillers all the time. Yeah. Now, the, the cost was definitely the biggest reason I wanted to do the implant. Yeah, it's more cost effective, I think, over the long term, too. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, we're going to go ahead and get started pretty soon, okay? All right, thanks.